Good evening, you hungry little bastards. Welcome to episode two of Mike's Flavor of the Month. January is over. On to February. If you're a hopeless romantic like me, February means only one thing. Valentine's Day. Now, when I'm cooking a Valentine's Day meal, I'm thinking something sexy, something hearty, something filling. So sit back, relax, because tonight I'm making stuffed Le'Veon bell peppers. Boom! these fancy little peppers we're gonna need a couple things here first of all we're gonna need peppers bell we're gonna be stuffing these I like to add a little Mexican twist to mine when I do it so I'm gonna be using first of all ground turkey healthier gonna put on top of that ground turkey a little uh, taco seasoning it's sort of like a taco stuffed pepper mixed in with that we're gonna have onion we're going to put in a little uh, habanero cheese. Helps them be a little stickier, stick together. Then with that uh, with that turkey, I add in a nice little, usually a little rice. I'm going to do spicy whole grain and quinoa today. Nice simple rice, ready in 90 seconds in the microwave. Mix them together. I'm going to be eating dinner in no time. This first thing here, got the, uh, got the old turkey starting in the pan there. Nice little heat. It's going to be cooking while I'm doing the rest of the prep. What I'm going to start with here is I'm going to get these peppers, these nice ones. We're going to hollow these bad boys out, get them ready for a stuffing. What you want to do, I've noticed, is try to find a pepper that sits nice and straight. That's going to be key when it comes to standing them up in the oven to get a little bait going on with them. So what I'm going to be doing here is just cutting the top, so getting rid of all the little cedars in there. Takes a little bit of work, but a little hollowing out. Get all the gross stuff out of there. Get them all ready for a ready for a good stuff. So get them all hollowed out already. Just get a regular baking sheet. Put them on there. Get them all set up, ready to be stuffed and ready to be thrown in the oven. I'm gonna move on to getting everything, all the fillings for the turkey already here. I'm going to start with getting some onion uh, chopped up. I'm going to be throwing it in with the turkey in the pan. Don't need too much. Just enough. Just enough to, you know, get a little flavor in there. Get a little crunch. Uh, I like to add the onion with the taco seasonings. It's kind of like you're making a taco inside of a pepper. It's a, it's a nice little touch there. You know, <clears throat> sometimes people ask me, they go, Mike, what's your favorite part about cooking? And I go, it's just uh, the freedom. You can be your own boss. I know you're probably looking right now and you're going, is that a, is that a green pepper? And the answer is yeah. And you're like, you're not putting that in the pepper. Are you not putting a pepper in a pepper? And I go, yeah, I am. Because I can. I'm my own, I'm my own boss out here. So I'm going to put these in to add to that sort of taco flavoring. It's going to be a nice little touch, I think. So we got the peppers all hollowed out. Turkey's done here, just gonna drain the fat out of them. Get it all good to go. Put it back there, gonna turn the heat down to it's a nice low heat. What we're gonna wanna do is we wanna put, with the seasoning it causes, it uh, calls to put a little bit of water in there with it. So I'm gonna put my seasoning in. I went with a mild, I'm using the habanero cheese and a couple other spicy factors, so won't be too bad. It says you want to add a little bit of water in with this or something just like water. I'm going to choose the alternative root here. It's basically the same thing. Get it in there. I find it adds a nice little awful unhealthy kick to it. Let's get our seasoning in there, a little bit of water. I'm going to add in the green pepper and onion. Get it ready to go. Stir that up. I'm going to put her on a nice little, nice little simmer after she's done here. 
Well, that's simmering away. I'm gonna get this uh, a little bit of rice I like to put in. I'm gonna put it in with it here. Uh, I got Uncle Ben's spicy whole grain quinoa. I'm gonna throw in the microwave here for 90 seconds. That's all she calls for. Then I'm gonna add it into the rice. <laughs> she done. So up there, we add our meat, and just stir that bad boy up. Ooh. Smells good. Smells good. Okay, it takes forever. Things almost all finished up here. Basically, I'm just gonna add a little cheese in on top, stir it up, make it nice and sticky so it uh, bunches up a nice little ball when I jam it in those peppers. So, once again, I'll put that habanero cheese on here. Mix her together and she should be good to go. Whole mixture is all ready here. Cheese is melted. Everything is looking good. I'm gonna start stuffing these peppers. Get them ready to go in the oven there. And we'll be eating in no time. Take the stickers off the peppers, or Amy's gonna be pissed. But uh, the key to these peppers, like I said earlier, you wanna get the peppers that stand up. Like this little guy right here, he's not, he's not, he's not doing anything. He won't stand up, it's a nightmare. So, maybe well, none of them stand up, actually, stick them. Now we got the peppers all stuffed here. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, you know, I'm gonna make this my own again. Like I said earlier, do what, do what you think's gonna be nice. Do what you think's gonna add some nice flavor. Go crazy if you want. I'm, uh, I got some cut up cilantro here. Add to that same little uh, Mexican touch I'm going for. I'm just gonna put them on top there before I put one final little coating of the habanero cheese on top. And these bad boys are ready to go in the oven. These are some good, good looking stuff. Le'Veon Bell peppers here. It's all set to go here. Got the oven set to three, uh, 350 for 10 minutes is what we're going to be doing. Oh. 10 minutes are up. The peppers out of the oven. Look at those bad boys. Take one of these right here. Oven says happy Valentine's Day like a nice hearty stuffed pepper. Boom. The moment of truth. Gave Amy her Valentine's Day pepper here. We're gonna do the scale of one <laughs> to yum. Yum. <laughs> Two yums. Two yums. Well, that's it for February. I guess I'll be back in the next month, March. Don't know what I'm going to cook, but I guess I'll see you guys then. Bye. <laughs>